That's odd. Vegeta should be close by. He's got to be around here somewhere. Hey, look over there! Vegeta! Time to finish what I started! Damn it! Who's there? Well, well. If it isn't the welcome wagon. <sighs> and I was so close to you. I wanted to off this impertinent prince. Before that woman could turn him into an hors d'oeuvre. What is he talking about? Although, that wouldn't change your pitiful fate as the main cause, would it? In fact, I may as well exterminate all of you now! Wait, Lord Teresa, please! Allow your humble servant to assist! We kill him! I guess the more things change, the more they stay the same, huh? And they do this, um, why again? Ahem. <clears throat> well, impressive. Now then, it will be my pleasure to watch all of you perish. I can see now why Cell was struggling so much. You have done quite well to tap into this much power. Sorry, Frieza. Looks like you're the one that's going to be doing the dying today. But before we blast you into microscopic pieces, you're going to tell us something. Oh, pray tell. When you said we'd be that woman's main course, what did you mean? Because as I see it, Android 21 is just trying to kill us. <laughs> Very well. I suppose I should reward you for that stimulating scuffle. No, Lord Frieza. There's no need to divulge information to the enemy. No need to worry. I merely want to fan the flame of fear that is to consume them. That woman. You refer to her as Android 21, if I am not mistaken. She fully devours warriors, which adds their strength to hers. It's a simply remarkable process. You're kidding! 
no serious. She turns her victims into candy treats. Just cruel, if you want my opinion. I see. So that's what her scheme is. Ish. I mean, talk about bizarre. That's not too different from Cell or Boo. Well then, if that's the case, we're pretty lucky to have found these guys before Android 21 could gobble them down. Oh, stop all your silly nonsense. I won't become more than 21. Nor crumble before you, cretins. Think you can get away from us, Frieza? <laughs> At once, my lord. Guldo, paralyze them! Damn it! Pardon your such sweet sorrow. Thank you for your sweet jealousy. I see. A lot has happened while I was out. Still. Letting Frieza slither away like that proves you're nothing but soft. You were made painfully aware of Guldo's power when you fought him on Namek. Y yeah, sorry about that. <sighs> Vegeta, I don't think you have room to talk right now. While you were sleeping like a Saiyan log, everyone was out fighting for the world. <laughs> uh, maybe we could just save the marital squabbles for later, huh? I know, I know, you're right. It's been some time since 21 flew off. Yeah, and if what Frieza said is true, 21 should be a lot stronger by now. That's right. It's high time you pull the plug on that oversized blender. Yeah, but we can't get a fix on 21's power. We don't know what we're dealing with yet. It doesn't matter how strong 21 gets. I'm sending her to the trash compactor. <sighs> there he goes again. Really, Vegeta? You were napping this whole time. You've never seen Android 21 in action. Kakarot! Just shut it! Look, we're glad you're on board, Vegeta. But you'd better get used to linking before taking on 21. Remember, without linking, we are utterly powerless. <laughs> That's certainly no way to fight. We don't know where the waves are coming from. We just have to accept it. <laughs> okay, okay. Settle down, everyone. And that goes for you too, Vegeta. Piccolo's the one who saved your butt when Frieza was about to fry you. I think you owe him some thanks. Oh, he acted on his own. I don't recall asking for help. Oh, is that how it is? Well, good. Because the thought of being thanked by you makes me want to hurl. What? What was that? <laughs> nice comeback, Vegeta. <laughs> so, uh, guys, it's time. Game plan. Let's clean up the baddies that we know are out there already. Look, we can't afford to let 21 chomp them down and then get even stronger. Good thinking. And fighting those clones? That would be some good link practice, too. The very thought of fighting with someone else in my body is just sickening. But I'll let it slide this once. Full power, I wouldn't need you here, 
so don't make me regret it. I'm just making the best of what is a bad situation. Still, I feel like the old Vegeta would have just fought alone anyway. I'm starting to think you've gotten soft, Vegeta. Think what you want. But know this. If you start holding me back, I'm not going to stick my neck out for you. <laughs> Trust me, I feel the same way. Owen, try not to get in my way, right? But do this, Vegeta. <laughs> I don't need you to tell me that.
don't care much for that woman, though. I suppose I should offer my thanks. After all, she has given me the perfect opportunity to dispose of the two of you rejects. <laughs> dispose of us? I was thinking the same thing about you. I can finally crush you with my two bare hands. Very well, then, if you wish to die that bad. Wait a sec! What do you want? Kakarot, stay out of this! Who says you get to fight first, Vegeta? It's not fair! Nobody cares! Quit bothering me! You got in my way the last time we fought Frieza, in case you don't remember. Yeah, well, sorry about that, but if you'll remember, I didn't have much of a choice. Whatever, just stay out of my way, and we'll call it even. Well, technically I saved you earlier, so aren't we already even? When you were knocked out and Frieza tried to attack you, I blocked the attack and saved you. Shut up! Why do you always bring that up? Now if you're done trying to steal my moment of glory, I have a fight to get to. Jeez, no need to be so moody, Vegeta. Just let me fight Frieza for a little bit, okay? Cool? A bit? Do I look stupid? Just let me fight! That is enough! You have some nerve making me listen to this juvenile squabbling! That's something I seriously cannot stand about the two of you mindless monkeys! If you two want to fight me so badly, then I'll just destroy you both at the same time! I'll crush the two of you with my bare hands! be fighting Boo like this again? This is awesome! Wow, I thought we saw the last of him after I used the spirit bomb to defeat him. Oh well, guess I'll just have to beat him with my own power this time. Kakarot, don't be naive. This one's different from the other clothes. Oh yeah? He doesn't seem all that different to me. Then, look at that. He's asleep? Falling asleep before a fight. I guess he really is different from the other clones. I think he's just messing with us. That's his first mistake. I say we wake him up. <laughs> Looks like he's awake now. To think of it, I wonder if he can't fight unless he does that. How the hell should I know? <laughs> this time, I'll be the one who finally puts an end to him. Hey, I'm not gonna let you hog all the fun.
and they're hurt. We gotta get them back to Boma. Goku, look, an enemy. Doesn't look like he's in the mood to let us go without a fight. No, he doesn't. Our only chance is to take him out. 